Okay guys, today we're going to be taking a look at one of the only Swiss Army knives or Victorinoxes that I use and why that is. So without any further ado, let's take a look at the Victorinox Huntsman. Now, if you've been around this channel or you're one of those lucky viewers, I get a lot of requests to feature or carry or why I don't carry more Victorinoxes or why I don't like using these types of Swiss Army knives or multi-tools. And really it goes back to a video that I did not so long ago basically saying that while I have nothing against Victorinoxes or Swiss Army knives personally, the issue that comes up with them very frequently is that while I can carry a lot of, or while the Swiss Army knife is equipped with a lot of tools that I like to have, such as saws, you know, knives, and that such, it's also equipped with a lot of knife or a lot of tools that I don't necessarily use. Things such as a corkscrew, uh, or things like a corkscrew, or a bottle opener, or a can opener. These are just things that, in an EDC setting, maybe I might use, but probably not still. And so I end up kind of discarding Victorinoxes because they have a lot of good features, but they also have a lot of bad features, or at least features that I'm never going to use. So why the Huntsman is special? So there are dozens of different models of Victorinoxes that have come out over the years, but the primary reason why I like the Huntsman over the rest is that as far as it goes with the whole tools that I like and that I want and the tools that I don't like and that I don't want, this is really the only Victorinox that for me does it. So they can, this knife has, so this Victorinox certainly has tools that I don't want, but it by and large has most of the tools that I want or at least that I would use. So starting off, of course, it does have, you know, the main blade. It also has a, if I can get to it, a little pen blade and I do really love this little pen blade for smaller crafting projects it also has a saw and for the few the last few tools that I do like to use on this knife it has a pretty good size of scissors and it has an awl and it also lastly has a little hook which are very hard to get open but these little uh, hooks are pretty phenomenal. Now, of course, this thing does have a corkscrew here, and it also has, you know, a can opener and a bottle opener, and a few other things such as the tweezers and the toothpick, which are all cool and fine and dandy. But that tool set that I just explained is the bulk of tools that, if I had to carry Victorinox, I'm going to realistically want and use. So, to put it shortly, I think that the Huntsman is probably one of the best bushcrafting Victorinoxes and one of the best uh, for outdoor use because it does have a few kind of weird tools for outdoor use but by and large this tool is vastly overlooked for some of the more popular models of Victorinoxes such as the Tinker and the Farmer but I think that the Huntsman is probably one of the better tools because of all of the tools that I just mentioned that it does have and if you are one of those people that is considering or does like to have Victorinoxes or carry them in the woods and you haven't picked up the Huntsman, I would highly encourage it. It is the tool, the Swiss Army knife, that I like personally most of all when it comes to uh, bushcrafting survival or really just being out in the outdoors in general. Okay guys, so that's really all I have to say about the Huntsman. This isn't going to be a phenomenally long video. Uh, these Victorinoxes are all reasonably the same as far as their use and what you can expect out of them. They are tiny, but just like a Leatherman, you know, things like the saw that you might take for granted, you know, in its size, you know, this isn't the largest saw, but it can get a tremendous amount of work done, especially if you're tactful with it and you know what you're doing. These things do one hell of a good job at carving out notches and smaller fine tasks like that. So anyways, guys, that's all for now. God bless and I'm out.